Year's Eve Party. Written by Curtis Norris. Illustrated by Agnes White. Paul lives with his family in a high-rise apartment in a big city. Christmas was a week ago, but there is lots of excitement in the house. In the kitchen, Mom is making little snacks with crackers and cheese. There is enough food to feed many people. In the living room, Dad is blowing up a lot of balloons. The whole room is filled with color. On the table, there are many funny hats and little horns. Paul toots a horn and wonders what it is all about. Is it someone's birthday? What's going on? asks Paul. It's New Year's Eve, the last day of the year, says Mom. We are going to have a party. At six o'clock, Paul's best friend Beth comes with her parents. Everyone puts on the funny hats. They eat the snacks and laugh and chat together. At nine o'clock, Paul says, "Mom, it is past my bedtime." Today is a special day," replies Mom. "Tonight you get to stay up late all the way to midnight." Paul thinks that is great. New Year's Eve might be the best day of the year. Paul plays with Beth late into the night. Then Paul's parents take him to the big balcony. There are thousands of happy people on the streets below. It's almost midnight, Mom says. Let's count down the last ten seconds. So Paul counts down with his mom. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One. Giant, colorful fireworks burst in the sky. Paul gets a big hug from his mom. It is a new year, and Paul is happy. He knows it will be the best year ever.